and take the blood myself. Are you going to use the same vein on the IV? No. no. So if you have to use the same hand, which most nurses do, right? Because, you know, if, if it's another hand, then the phlebotomist will do it. You're going to find a vein that's what? Totally different from the IV site. Okay? So you're going to have to move your own tape. So you're the only one that can do it. Or your RN. Or your team, right? Or your team. You could be working with another VN. You move your tape and you're going to look for that vein that's not connected to your IV. So I have a side vein here that's good. Okay? So watch me, ladies. So, and you can take off your, um, this is the time you can take off your syringe, correct? And you can lock it, right? Because the patient really don't need a syringe unless, of course, you're giving meds. So you're going to lock this here. And that's what we call a saline lock or hep lock because of the lock. Okay? So I'm like, okay, it's time for me to take blood. So, equalize, what's next? Good, thank you. Whatever's under? And top on top, okay? And so, what do we do with this? We take off the clear. Are you guys watching? Mm -hmm. Take off the clear right here, the white, not the green. The green is the needle, so be careful. Okay, I know it's the end of the day. By the way, do we keep our sterile field sterile without yes. packaging? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so this is how you hold this. Two fingers below and thumb on the top. And this should be a line on the top. Why? So it doesn't roll. If you're anything else like this, like this, like this. So please do it. Two fingers. What happened is that your this two fingers right here, will land on the skin and you never take this off it stays there for the whole procedure it's actually very simple you see this it lands on the skin now where does your tube go your tube is on the hand that's not working correct do not put it in your sterile field there should be no package in your sterile field okay this is how you hold but this is how you put in the tube when you're in the skin it's important to Put it in, put your thumb at the butt of the tube, and then you're going to, two fingers, use the wings, okay? Let's take off the green cap. Hold on, watch me first. If there's any tape that's disturbing you, it needs to go, okay? And we're going to 20% in, 20, 30. You're gonna grab, hold of the tube, Again, like we said, butt and two fingers, okay? So, blood draw, as long as you are done with your tube, and there should be markings there, correct? You should look at your tube, what's the minimum marking, how much blood you're going to collect, but you're so done. So, before we take out the, ne the needle, what do we need to do, ladies? Two things. Turn a K and... But we don't want to put pressure on when the needle is in there because your patient will really not like you because it hurts. So we just, just slowly take it out and then, okay? Please don't lock this. Just mm -hmm. park it, okay? And then you need a fat tape. To stop the bleed, you need fat tape. Okay, ladies, 